YouTube Laughing Pikachu here welcome back to another video and today we have the Shining Legends shiny Dark Ride GX figure collection box I am so excited about this there's a link in the description you can of course pick these up from over the top TCG but I actually got this from a pokey hunt that I will be showing you guys in the next couple of days uh, there's some really cool things that we got in that and uh, this is just one of the many awesome things but I wanted to get this up as soon as possible uh, because this is a relatively new product and there are some lovely Shining Legends packs in here and we do have a case of these lovely guys coming our way very soon from the lovely over the top PCG uh, so we're gonna be doing a really really intense um, hunt for the hyper rare Raichu video coming soon but for now um, we're gonna just have four packs and then I'm gonna do it like a slower video showing you guys what you can expect to find in these lovely shiny dark ride collection boxes now cool thing about these so first of all I don't know why they include so much plastic like it seems a bit excessive in my opinion but I'll take it, I'll take it. So here's what the promo looks like, and I'll go ahead and quickly pop that out and show it to you guys. Uh, but it's actually a pretty nice promo. This is a Shining Dark Ride GX, oh snap, look at that. Oh, it's beautiful, guys. And as you can see, um, we have A right there, which is stands for alternate art. Thank you guys in the, for the people in the comments who like helped me. Last time I, I had a video like this and I showed off a promo, I was like, I don't know what the A means. And then you guys commented and I read the comment. So it works, oh my gosh, thank you you guys thank you anyway so here's what it looks like i think it's a pretty dope looking promo card if i do say so myself we'll stick that in the back we also have the dark ride figure right here um i like how recently they've been making a lot of figures that are just like one piece uh, i know in the past they used to make them with like like with like a stand and like all the stuff that you had like put together and it's so easy to lose all the little tiny pieces so it's just one lovely figure right here um nothing that you need to put together no pieces that you can lose and it's purple um because it is a shiny dark red Ooh! oh snap all right so we'll stick that figure in the background and just knocked over a couple of things but that's okay anyways uh we'll stick this plastic off to the side let's get this fixed up really quickly just just to make sure the whole gang is just ready to go boom all right there we go um and then here's what we get so let's zoom in so as you can see oh my gosh guys look at look at how pretty pretty that is and we are home right now so that's why we have this whole setup going on right there but anyways uh, we have the these things that they have been including recently in pokemon products why do they do this i don't know but they do so if you want to go to the pokemoncenter.com slash new then you can and it'll do stuff here is a code card for you guys oh my gosh whoa a shiny dark red gx code you're welcome you've been blessed all right we have four packs two of the shining mew so you know it's gonna be good luck guys if we get two of the shining mew all right so we have a shiny rayquaza if you watch the videos that i did with allison you know that um her favorite shining pokemon from shining legends is in fact the shining rayquaza so so maybe we can pull that in honor of her today. Um, also, of course, the Alolan Raichu, or sorry, not Alolan, the Hyper Rare Raichu would be fantastic. Uh, but there's a lot of great things in Shining Legends, including a Shining Mew. Um, so I would honestly be happy with pretty much anything. We have a Minin, a Damage Mover, and a Latios Holographic. Oh, snap. All right, now we have the Mewtwo pack art. Peanut Pikachu's favorite Pokemon, I think. I don't know. He's like always debating between Mew and Mewtwo. So who knows? He's a, he's a crazy kid. So maybe one day he's gonna like Pikachu the best. Not happening. Uh, maybe a monkey. <gasps> oh my gosh! If he likes monkeys the best, though, I'm not sure what's gonna happen next. Like I don't, I don't think that this will like end well. Like Peanut Pikachu liking monkey. Oh my gosh. We n it's okay. No, we accept we accept monkeys on the show. Anyways, we have a quillfish in. Oh snap, yo! I see something. Is that a hyper? Oh my gosh, wait, it's actually hyper rare. Oh my goodness, wait guys, I'm like freaking out right here. I'm like dancing in the chair. Did we freak? Oh my gosh, Zoroark GX, guys, guys. Okay, first of all, I am very happy about this. This is a lovely card. One of the most, I think it actually might be the most expensive card in this set. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, let's try and up the brightness just a little bit so you can see a little better. That is very nice, beautiful card. Um, very, very thrilled about this. I'm very excited right now. This is absolutely lovely. Um, I do want to say something though. So. One Hyper Rare Raichu has been pulled on the channel, and that is it. And I did not pull it. Allison pulled it um, in a video. And so I have pulled 
uh, I think maybe at, at least three of the Hyper Rares or I've pulled multiple copies of the Hyper Rare Mewtwo and the Hyper Rare Entei. So literally every card in this Shining Legend set, um, every Hyper Rare, I have pulled at least one copy of and I've opened up like hundreds upon hundreds of packs of Shining Legends, but I have not pulled a Hyper Rare Raichu. Um, so, in case you guys are wondering why I'm always talking about the Hyper Rare Raichu card, it is because I literally have not pulled it, despite opening hundreds upon hundreds of packs. Okay, so we have a lovely Pikachu, which will stick in the back, Ekans, which is snake spelled backwards, Zoro, Buizel, Plusle, a Kelio Reverse, which is a reverse, um, typically a hollow card, so that's very nice, and we have a Hoopa Holographic, oh my gosh, the camera is so bright, alright, let's put, turn it down a little bit. Um, that is a Hoopa Holographic from Shining Legends. Oh, snap, guys. Alright, so we have two Hollows. We have a Hyper Rare. We have the Shining Dark Rite GX promo card. And we have one final pack to go. It is the Mewtwo, or sorry, the Shining Mew. Oh, my gosh. Alright, I'm just freaking out. Alright, here we go. We are starting off with a Fire Energy, Spiritomb, Pokemon Breeder, Electrode, Breloom, Minin, Larvesta, Torkoal, Ivysaur, Energy Retrieval, and a Shaman Hollow. Very, very nice. But guys, I just want you guys, I, I want to put this into perspective. This is an extremely expensive card. Like, this single card here paid for the entire box. Which, like, you know, when I open these things, of course, you know, the main reason is not to make a profit or, you know, hope that I'm going to make money by pulling these cards. Because the reality of it is, if you're getting into Pokemon cards expecting that, it's never going to happen. Uh, because Pokemon cards are expensive and most of the time you're going to lose money. But this is a big deal. I just, like, I just bought this box, I pulled the Zoro GX, and, like, I... I like, this single card here paid for the entire box, which is always a really great feeling. So, anyways, as a little recap, sorry, I'm, like, freaking out right now. Um, we have the Hyper Rare Zoroark GX, not the Hyper Rare Raichu, but that is okay, my friends. We also have a Dark Rai GX Shining Promo with the alternate art denotation right there. We have a Shaman Hollow, Hoopa Hollow, Latios Hollow, Keldeo Reverse, and a Pikachu. That was like reverse epicness order, but still, very awesome. Thank you guys so much for watching, and again, if you want to pick one of these up, Over the Top TCG is a great place to check them out. We do have a booster case, or sorry, a case of these um, coming very soon, so please do stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching guys and don't ever be ashamed to be you because you are your own type of beautiful bye guys